So, which are the best drinks for optimal brain performance? Well, let's find out. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Greg and I'm a brain hacker creating content that will help you upgrade your brain performance. And if those topics interest you, then subscribe below and join our amazing community. Now today we're gonna talk about the best drinks for optimal brain performance. Now, first of all, you need to know that our brain contains about 80% of water and water is involved in every chemical reaction that happens in our brain. And why is this important? Well, obviously because first and the most important drink, you need to drink enough as water. Because if you get dehydrated, if you don't drink enough water, your cognitive function will decrease, uh, you will feel less alert, you have issues with concentration, and last but not least, you may even experience brain fog. And that's the last thing you want to do. Now, most often when people experience brain fog is actually because they are dehydrated. So if you drink about two liters or about 8.5, cups of water per day, you should be fine. But if you ever experience any issues with cognitive function, then just increase the amount of water and see if this helps you out. Now, what happens if you add a little bit of lemon to the water you're drinking? Well, lemon contains vitamin C, but also potassium. And potassium is very interesting because it allows more oxygen to reach the brain. And more oxygen basically improves your cognitive function. So if you don't like drinking water, just add a little bit of lemon to it and you have a better tasting drink, which is probably even better for your cognitive performance. Another drink is beet juice. Now beet juice is probably not the tastiest drink in the world, but really good for your brain function because it contains nitrates and nitrates increase the blood flow to the brain. And of course this positively impact your brain function. By the way guys, if you like this video, please press the like button below. Now, how about green tea? Green tea is very popular, uh, a popular drink because among other benefits, it does contain L-theanine. And this is a very popular amino acid because of many benefits that it delivers. And you can learn more about it up here. Now, green tea is really good because it can decrease your anxiety, it can improve your concentration and your focus, and it can even increase the amount of dopamine. And because of that, it is great for cognitive function. And of course, I personally highly recommend drinking green tea or taking l as a supplement. Now, we can't talk about brain performance drinks without mentioning coffee. Why? Well, because coffee contains caffeine, which is the world's most widely used psychoactive drug. And there is no doubt that coffee can improve your focus, your concentration, boost your uh, cognitive performance and function, and it also boosts your energy levels. But drinking coffee usually comes with a few side effects. First of all, if you drink coffee too late, it can negatively impact your sleep, even cause insomnia. Secondly, it forces your adrenal glands to produce more stress hormone cortisol, and this can lead to adrenal fatigue. And thirdly, many people experience an energy crash about an hour or so after they drink a cup of coffee. Now you can avoid some of those side effects by drinking bulletproof coffee, which is basically a coffee combined with MCT oil, an extract of coconut oil. And you can learn more about bulletproof coffee up here. But based on the fact that MCT oil contains high amounts of saturated fats, which is not the best fat for your heart health, bulletproof coffee is probably not the healthiest drink in the world that you should drink every single day. Of course, if you monitor your levels of saturated fats, well, that's how you can stay on the safe side, but still keep this in mind. Now, another way is to take caffeine uh, in the powder form, so as a supplement or in capsules, and you combine it with L-theanine, which we mentioned before. And this combination can bring all the benefits without any kind of known side effects besides the potential impact on sleep, but you can avoid those issues if you take those capsules in the morning. By the way, guys, all of those drinks are part of our Brain Hacker's Diet. Now, what exactly is Brain Hacker's Diet? Well, check out the link in the description where you can learn more about it. Another drink is Jerba Mate tea. Now, this is a tea that is a traditional drink in South America, and it contains some caffeine, but a little bit less than coffee, but it also contains many antioxidants, and it's a very healthy drink. Now, compared to coffee, Jerramate gives you a slow releasing energy boost and it's really good, much better than coffee for learning, for studying, for reading, researching and that kind of work. And if you want to learn more about it, check out my video up here. And we should also talk about cacao. 
Cacao is a very popular drink and a popular energy booster because of two reasons. First of all, it contains theobromine and theobromine is a mild stimulant. And secondly, it contains a compound called PEA. And this compound can increase your energy levels, your concentration and alertness. And that's why cacao is a great drink for improving and boosting your brain performance. Now, if you combine those drinks with the best brain foods for optimal brain health, that's how you're gonna achieve the best results. But which are the best brain foods on the market? Well, check out my video up here. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to follow your inception, subscribe below. And guys, I hope to see you soon again. Take care.